Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we're going to jump back and look at OS, the OS module, and we're going to look at the scander method, but we're really going to kind of dig into dir entry objects. So all right, let's just let's just look at this. All right, if you're new here, thanks for joining us. And if you aren't and you're just running across us, we do tons of videos and we'd love to have you subscribe and hit the notification bell and just hang in there with us and see, see what you can learn. So, all right, this is a interesting method and then these, it creates objects. So, all right, let's try in here. And then also, I want you to draw your attention because we're getting more, more in depth, more technical, um, more complicated. So, all right, iterator. If you're seeing this and you're not sure what it is, what we do here is we have everything that we're explicitly talking about is new. If we're not explicitly talking about it, we've done previous videos. So, all right, let's create a object and. If you don't give it a path, it's going to do the current path you're in up here. So, all right, for i in x, print i. Let's run this. So there's everything. It's creating uh, a object all the way through. So, all right, and I just printed it out. But let's just say I want to go through and look and dig in for each object at a time. Scan dir. So all right, this is. And we're gonna do x1. Next, x. So all right, let's dig into this. So here is my, here's my object. Now I'm gonna run dir on x1. So now I ran dir, and I want you to look really close. We these are all going to look like methods. They're all going to look like methods, but they're not. So, all right, let's look. Let's run help on it so we can really make sure we understand. So, all right, here are the methods. Then here are variables. So I'm going to show you. So right, our x1 is that. So now I'm going to run. Let's pull this back up. Dir on x1. So, all right, x1.inode, there's my node, i on is a dir, is it a directory, all right, is uh, x1 dot is file. Now, all right, so now look at this name this is a this is a variable so drop drop the parentheses and then same thing with x1 dot path and there we go so this is what took me a while to figure out that's why we use our help and our dir and to distinguish and differentiate so this is a very cool method and then it creates objects and we know how to do all this we have our help we have our dir and then we even have a video out there for a deep dive into help and dir so just a real quick video today i uh, just wanted to touch on this um, and I can't say thank you enough for all the views and all the subscribers. And please don't hesitate to leave any comments, questions, or my absolute favorite, any video requests below. Because you guys are really helping me drive this channel to the way that it needs to be. So thanks again. Don't forget to click the like and subscribe button. And most important, the notification bells. And keep the comments coming. Thanks, guys. See you next time.